Hi YouTube. Um, this is a quick little video I wanted to make. I know I have a lot of haters out there. Um, they've been the last a lot disliking my video, so I'm gonna be trying to turn that around. And yeah, as you can see in front of us, we had the PSP original that I bought off EB Games for fifty-eight or fifty-five dollars. So let's turn it on. Let's see, it's turning on. Let's turn the volume up a little. Okay. The PSP has a safe daughter utility. This can hold up to a 16 gigabyte maximum from recent sales. Game sharing is like a wireless connection, like the DS. This also has the ability to search the internet and PSN. The PlayStation Network is also another achievement. You can sign up for PlayStation Network. PlayStation Store or Information Board. Then we have video. This takes up UMD discs from videos such as House of Wax, Flight Control, The Terminal. Then we have Sense Me channels. It's kind of like iTunes. We have a camera. You can import them from your camera or your computer. Extras. Digital Comics. This takes up internet and like you don't know what a digital comic is. Next we have a system update. You press the X key and you get a system update, USB connection, video settings, photo settings, system settings, beam settings, date and time settings, power save settings, so this is like airplane mode and stuff like that. Sound settings, security settings, RSS channel settings, network settings. So if we go to security settings, parental control level 9, that means like you hardly get anything, like no bad things happening to you. And you can play any game practically. Okay, so let's talk about some of the main keys. Up. Okay, let's turn it off to save battery. You can only use one key during the game, and that is this one. This is kind of like a bump stick that you can use only with games and videos as you can see it's a very thick one it has black down the bottom so it's not so perfectly covered next we have the dial the d-pad as a regular every console has a d-pad this also can be used next we have the power button and then the charger and yeah and we have home, volume, brightness, music, select, start, right button, L button, charge, wireless connection, open, put your disc in there. I'm hoping to buy one of these and opening it up and like putting a um, blue range in them. So tune in later for that, maybe a couple of years, one year. Then we have the where we put our memory card. This has no memory card. Turn it on to wireless. On wireless. Yeah, that's practically everything you need to know about uh, PSP. The original PSP. So, this PSP is beautiful. I love it. It's thick though. It's portable. It's great. It has some great graphics. And um, the home button, I'll just show you what it does. They're pretty thick to press down. be good if I had a touch screen, but you know the save data utility it's pretty random so yeah I hope I taught you a lot and please like and subscribe maybe comment and tell me what I can improve on and yeah thanks guys see ya